um, me and Celia Keenan Bolger. Oh, and she is uh, fantastic. Celia is fantastic. You saw her in Mockingbird. I saw her in right? The Killer Mock. I don't she won the Tony for that. She was unbelievable. She's, she's in amaz that. an amazing actor, and both of them are amazing actors. So that was Jim Parsons and Jimmy Fallon talking about the incredible <laughs> Celia Keenan Bolger. <laughs> Celia and Jim are starring together alongside Jessica Lang in the new show, Mother Play, and we are so excited to have her with us now. Welcome back. Good to see you. Oh, it's so nice to be here. I mean, were you watching The Tonight Show when that was on? No, I wish I had, but I did get some texts from people. I'm like, sure. Oh, we're getting like, some love from Jimmy Fallon and Jim Parsons. I feel like if you're a theater actor, you don't expect anybody to really know who you are. Oh so my God. I, that yeah, was... I, get, I can see that, but it's, I don't think that's the case anymore. <laughs> I think that a lot of theater actors, too, are, you know, Starting to, cross Starting to cross over, over what you have done with the Gilded Age, which we'll get to in a second. Yeah. But let's talk about this show. Um, it's called a, a play in five evictions, mm -hmm. um, and it spans forty years. So, mm -hmm. can you just set this up for us? Well, it, it's a family. You know, there's a long history of American plays that revolve around family, and this is no different. Except that this one is written by a woman. Yeah. And this one, instead of staying in, when I think of family drama, I think like, oh, it's just like one living room. We stay with the family. This has. Um, five different living rooms. Oh my God. And so we are constantly moving apartments. We're getting evicted from the apartments for various reasons. Um, but really it's a play about being in a family and yeah. the relationship I think between siblings, Jim Parsons being my brother and our mother, Jessica Lang. Um, mm. And incredible. I mean, incredible. It just sounds like something that everybody can relate to. I mean, everybody is. <laughs> We're all in a family. Yeah. We all have a mother, regardless of what our relationship is. Yeah. And I think it really, it does an amazing thing because we, we go through so many decades of time. It's like what that dynamic, what our dynamics are with our family starting out and then how we end up and how those patterns continue and how we try to break out of those patterns and yeah. those dynamics and how we try to accept each other and forgive each other and love each other. You know, I think it's a really, it's emotional. Yes, <laughs> it yeah. is emotional. It oh. is emotional. And so the playwright, Paula Vogel, she yeah. wrote this with you in mind and it's, it's semi-autobiographical, right? It is. So how did that make you feel when she reached out and said that? Cause that's such a I compliment. I mean, you know, Paula is, I think one of the great American playwrights. And a while ago she said, you know, I, I'm writing something for you. And I was like, oh, I'm not going to think about that too much because if it doesn't happen, I'll be really sad. Yeah. <laughs> and then she like sent me the script. She was like, I have your play. And I was like, oh my God, I can't wait. I can't wait. And then I started reading it I was like oh my god I'm like playing a version of Paula oh. which comes I think with a lot of responsibility yes. but also I was but, so but honored that she wanted you to play a version of her is such a huge honor it is it yeah really is. and so as a mother yourself is there any part of this play that really hits home for you Oh my gosh, I mean, I hope I'm a different kind of mother than yes. Jessica Lang is in this play but I do think there is something that she says, she has a long speech at the end when she talks about, and it, this is something I think about a lot, that I don't think anybody ever told me as a mother that my emotional well-being would be so wrapped up in my child's yes. emotional mm. well-being that it's like, if your kid is doing great, you're doing great. Yes. If your kid is having a hard time, it's not that easy. And this mother does go on a real journey with her children, mm. and then I think that part of it is very resonant with me as a mother. Mm, mm, mm. It's so hard to watch things when uh, when you're a mother. That it kind is. Of it. So it must be even harder when you're playing it. But um, <laughs> So let's talk about The Gilded Age for a second mm. because we were talking about the crossover. You are on The Gilded Age, which is like a who's who of the best of Broadway. Is. So is it almost like a sisterhood when you're on yes. set? I mean, I feel like it's a bunch of theater nerds being able to be like, oh, we're on this amazing show. And it's really, it's, it's such a high level of artistry. I think Christine Baranski said, she was like, we're like a repertory company. Yes. And I was like, I mean, I'll take, I, to be a part of that rep company, I feel very, very lucky. Mm, it's a great show. I'm so glad it got renewed Me for too. season three. Um, I'm so glad you're here too. Thank you so much for coming. And you can catch a mother play at the Hayes Theater. For tickets, head to 2st.org. Second stage. Second stage.